Hi guys, we are out on the beach and uh, yeah, it was quite stormy in the last 24 hours. So hopefully, fingers crossed, we'll find some goodies. All right, see you in the first hole. Bye. First little find of the day. Found a coin. Found a coin. Okay. Found another coin. Not exactly sure what we got. Possibly an old pound coin with a leak on it. And another one. They are coming out. I've never ever found so many one pound coins. I'm loving this. <laughs> okay, another coin right next to the other coin. And... Oh wow, that's a half penny. <laughs> See one of them for a while. Let's see what the date is. Not sure if I've ever seen a better example of a extreme cutaway. <laughs> so where it is all along here, you've got this massive drop, you can see it on the wall there. That's like a 10 foot wall. So I'm going about 10, 15 feet in front of that. And if you see here, it's kind of all in layers. And there's a few little bits down there. Okay. And Another half penny from a very big hole. <laughs> okay, and they're just keeping on coming. See a penny, pick it up. Okay, so there is a little tiny little step here where the bottom layer has washed away. It's not coming out across too clear, but there is a very so that's like a whole layer that's just gone. Awesome what we like to see. And 50 p Ka-ching! And another 20 p guys welcome to my little roundup um a very bizarre one today so i wasn't out particularly long um there isn't that much footage because it, it was really windy and uh a lot of the footage was just horrible noise um and also my battery was quite low so it's kind of short one but lots and lots lots of coins this was after some very stormy weather and some big waves i'll stick the waves uh in the video somewhere I've never found so many coins and so little rubbish. I was, I've, I've been out after storms before and there's still bottle tops. There's still, I mean, I've got a few, but they're super, super rusty. Look at that one. That's been in there a long time. Um, but yeah, not a lot else, which I found quite peculiar, if I'm honest. Uh, so I don't know why that was or why anyone would know maybe it's all blown up the coast somewhere maybe it's all in margate anyway so a little bit of roundup um lots of pound coins lots and lots of pound coins um 13 to be precise a couple of them very very old ones uh well not very old but very battered uh with leaks on so there's two that i found with leaks on um which was kind of cool uh lots of other ones various different states some are a lot more obviously been down there a bit longer than others um but yeah that's kind of cool a couple of 50ps that have seen better days this one 
just very dark. You can always tell the ones that have been down there the longest just for the, like, just lost their sheen totally. A um, couple of random ones. Five cent, which I guess we expect to see because uh, a lot of people have them and they're all over Europe now. I think we're the only country that doesn't. But a Barbados five cents. So I don't know if that's just kind of been in the mix because it's almost, I don't know, that's a half penny. Almost the same size, same colour as a penny. So maybe they've just kind of got mixed in with circulation somehow. I don't know. A bit random. Um, and some half pennies, which obviously have been out of circulation. For, oh no, that's 5p. Sorry, I thought that was a... It's hard to tell, isn't it? It might actually be a 5p. Ignore me. That's a half p. <laughs> um, yeah, that might focus. But yeah, so some I can spend, some I can't. Always nice. Um, now, on to my aluminium fascination. Um, last week, there was these two or my last video, uh, from Bex Hill, which was the aluminium with the rivet holes in it. Um, and we had this, uh, I had a conversation or messages with a guy who said he thought could have come from plane. Someone else said could have come from boats. There's a fisherman I spoke to who said, you know, some boats are used aluminium to patch them. So I don't know. But found this, which again is aluminium, but a very different super super light even lighter than this aluminium um again with some sort of holes in it um but that was, looks like a rim so i don't know if that would be the rim of a boat or the rim of something else and this one which is a slightly different feel again so yeah i don't know i mean maybe maybe it is boats i don't know uh because there is i'm, I'm finding it quite regularly especially with the holes in. Um, but yeah, so it's either a boat's gone down or plane. Don't know. But if you know, I'm fascinated by this, please give me a shout. Uh, anyway, so yeah, that's it. Just a little quick one. Uh, like and subscribe for my next adventure and uh, hopefully chat with you guys in the comments. Oh, and a little cheeky fossil, <laughs> which I found as well. Don't forget about that one. Anyway, have a great day, guys. Thanks. Happy hunting.